Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Neo Scavenger. We, uh, we're doing quite well actually, we've got a fair bit of stuff, we're surviving, we're quite good at that now. Um, oh, there's some corner cola here. Um, yeah, we're not doing too badly at all. We've got a nice crowbar, we've got a nice compound bow, we've got binoculars, we've got some drugs, uh, prescription and so on. We've got these water testers, one of them I can still use, I believe. We've got a flashlight, we've got some cooked meat, uh, tannin tea. It's nice, it's quite nice, and uh, yeah. I'm pretty sure that means we're gonna die very quickly now. We're very weary, so we need to find a place to sleep. And I think I also want to change this uh, plastic shopping bag because sooner or later it's going to fall apart and I do not want that There we go. I'm going to take all this Okay, I don't need that one. So I'm just gonna take that. Okay now We are going to sleep. What is it? It's day still um, I am going oh great. I'm going to try Oh, it's already uh, evening now. Excellent. So that is good, but I don't want these guys around. Yeah, exactly. That guy has a gun. So if I sleep here, yeah, there's no good place to sleep. I do not like the look of that one. So if I sleep here... A ruined bungalow, it's not really great. Or... Ooh, that is very nice. Look at that. But I need to make... Oops. Some warning for myself. There we go. And another one. Because with two of them, it seems like you can be quite nicely secured. There we go. Alert alertness pretty much up to full. Um, anything else we need to do? No. Let's sleep. And hopefully that will alert us to any anyone or anything that would be approaching us. Excellent. It's still night, but that's all right. I am probably going to eat this chunk of meat. Yeah, not just yet, but I will soon because it's in pretty poor condition. Let's dismantle the traps. Because we want them... Oh, not enough to craft. Okay. Because I want to get those back. I wonder if you get everything back. I don't know, really. Oh. There we go. Where did this one come from? Oh, it was, it was probably already here. Oh, crap. Take cover. Ah, great, it's a dogman. Dogman has stripped and has fallen to the ground and must regain footing to continue. Oh, dog... Uh, player woke up, player takes cover. Okay. Mm, can I hide? Not really. Let's wait. Doing nothing. Yep, dogman crawls towards player. Dogman advance. Oh, Dogman gets up. Okay. Dogman charges at player. Well, we're gonna try the same thing as usual. It seems to work quite well. Uh, this is pretty good though because we're unburdened. We'll, we're well rested, so we're pretty much um, prepared for this guy. He's only tough. He's not strong, so that's uh, to our advantage. Dogman is exposed. We could try to shoot. Oh, never mind, because we don't have it equipped. Can we equip it now? Apparently we can. Hmm. It's actually... N oh, no. Never mind. Never mind. I would have to... Hmm. Actually, let's do that. Okay. Um. Wait. Ranged. Blast away. Launch a volley of ranged attacks. Chance to hit target three times. No, let's just do a ranged attack. And we missed, of course, because it's uh, night time. Ranged attack. Excellent. Lacerated Dogman's upper stomach with a compound bow with a crude broadhead. Excellent. Uh, well, let's fire away at again. Why not? Uh, we missed. Fire again. Excellent. Has fallen to the ground and must regain footing. Player lacerated Dogman's upper left arm with a compound bow. Uh, Dogman is stunned and unable to move for a moment. Well... Another arrow we have, and we missed. Okay, never mind that. Let's uh, advance under cover. Dogman gets up. Let's wait for him then, because he's going to charge. Yep, 
Let's wait again. There we go. He's already there. That's not good. Oof. Uh, we should probably parry, but I'm going to... He's tough. Oh, he is tough now. Okay. Vulnerable. Well, let's attack him then. Um, let's see. Player attacks Dogman and hits. Player demolished Dogman's upper right leg with a crowbar. Bloody hell. Dogman cannot run in combat. He's fallen to the ground and must regain footing. Dogman's right leg has been crippled. A stunt is severe pain and is having trouble concentrating. Dogman tries to tackle player but misses. Wow, excellent. He's stunned, severe pain, ble bleeding. Let's do another melee. I don't want to melee search because that uh, we lose a turn for that. And yeah, it's not really great. Dogman is coughing up blood. Player wailed on Dogman's upper stomach with a crowbar. Bloody hell. Player demolished Dogman's lower right arm with a crowbar. Dogman's right arm has been crippled. Dogman is unconscious, has passed out from unbearable pain. And now we can kick him while he's under th uh, on the ground. <laughs> Let's just melee surge and kill him. Player demolished Dogman's leader's lower chest with a crowbar. Concussion is someone disoriented. He's died of a severe traumatic brain injury. And we have another Dogman here. <laughs> and the lovely thing is we um, also got these back. At least two. I think we had th four to start with? I don't know. Um, yeah, there's unfortunately not much I can do with it. If I had a vehicle, I would certainly cut him up and uh, sell the fur. But, yeah, I can't really do anything with it. I guess I could replace my fur. But, meh. Meh. I'm going to leave it as it is. Well, that was interesting. Oh, bloody hell, of course, he was a leader. And there's another one now. Ugh. Right, um, let's take cover first. I just like taking cover, even though I know it's just apparently to, because of ranged uh, weapons. Um, well, let's do the same thing as before. The The bow certainly is useful, because it um, softens them up. From how far away? I wonder if the game actually takes into account the distance. Is it more difficult to hit from a great distance or not? Right, let's... Uh, Actually, I'm going to wait a little bit until he comes closer. There we go. Now he's exposed. So I'm going to ranged attack him. Damn it. We missed. But he's... Oh, now I'm, I'm exposed. Okay. He's still vulnerable. Let's ranged attack. And we missed. Brilliant. So never mind that. Okay, I'm going to wait. There we go. He's charging. Let's fall back so we can have as much distance as possible. Uh, oh, damn it. Because I wanted to do that... Dogman advances. I wanted to do the uh, obstacle thing. Dogman charges at player. He's exposed, so I can just melee attack him now. Player attacks Dogman and hits. Smack Dogman's lower right arm with a punch. Dogman tries to launch a flurry of attacks at player, but misses. Okay, excellent. Let's create an obstacle. Uh, Dogman needs a moment. Player knocks some debris towards Dogman. Dogman's lower chest was whipped. Let's do another obstacle. Player knocks some debris, and Dogman's head was scratched, Dogman's upper right arm was whipped, and he's bleeding. Let's melee attack him. Uh, we hit and bruise Dogman's upper right arm with a punch. Let's make another obstacle. Th I love this um, skill. It's the strong skill, I believe, and it almost usually works, and it's brilliant. Um, Dogman's lower stomach was whipped. Dogman tries to tackle player but misses. Dogman has fallen to the ground and must regain footing and is exposed to easy attack for the moment. I should probably make another obstacle, but he's fallen so I'm going and vulnerable, so I'm going to melee attack. Oh no, I'm using a punch, of course. I, I need to uh, use the crowbar. There we go. Dogman cannot run in combat. Wailed on Dogman's right leg with a crowbar. Right leg has been crippled. Dogman is stunned and unable to move, is in severe pain and is having trouble concentrating. Let's kick him! Player kicks Dogman while they're down. Dogman's lower left arm was pelted. Dogman needs a moment to recover. Let's kick him again! Player kicks Dogman. Dogman's upper left arm was pelted. Kick him! <laughs> Dogman needs a moment to recover. Upper chest was pelted. Has fallen to the ground and must regain footing to continue. Okay, he's getting up. Let's melee attack him. Dogman is unconscious because we smacked Dogman's upper left leg with a crowbar. Has passed out from unbearable pain. Melly surge! And we demolished his lower chest with a crowbar. 
and he's died to acute due to acute bleeding in the lungs. Wow. Can you say Dogman Terminator? <laughs> Look at that. His buddy is here and we just rock. Unfortunately, we've got no more um arrows, but I believe we can still make some with trapping. I just need some wood for that. Okay, that was pretty amazing. And we're fairly tired from kicking all those dogmen's asses. So, oh, not enough moves. Okay, that's fair enough. It's very dark. Right, let's try to make some arrows, see how that works. I should have... Somebody said you can actually reverse engineer stuff. Hmm. Yeah, reverse engineer stuff so you can uh, learn the recipe. So let's see. Crude torch, extinguish small forest resources, glass shift, meat and hide, medium campfire, noise trap, patchwork, quality torch, oh, quality torch, small kindling, medium shaft, small flammable, non rigid sheet, rough splint, sharpened spear, small campfire, and dam. I was hoping we knew how to make an arrow. Now, let's think, what else would you need? Probably some... no. Wait a second, trapping. Hmm. I mean, I would obviously need something on the back to use as feathers. So it could fly properly. I mean, it can be just sharpened. But apparently that's not really enough. Yeah, this will give us a sharpened spear, which I kind of don't need. Hmm. Sorted small parts. String? No. Snare. Ah, that's how you make a snare. With both the assorted small parts and string. Okay. Medium thread. No, that's not really what I want. Uh, well, I don't think I'm gonna find it out. Oh well. The next arrow I find, I will disassemble and see what, what I need for it, I guess. I will need to find some water as well. Oh, great. Oh, crap. And there's two of them. Oh, crap. That's not good. Uh, desperate retreat, please. Oh, no, 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 no. Dogman leader is bleeding. Dogman is bleeding. They're both bleeding. We can't get away. Oh, no, 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 no. This is not good. This is not good at all. <laughs> Headbutt the target. Chance to injure target, knock them down, and force them to lose next turn. High chance of being detected must be tough. Let's let's try that then. That looks good. Player headbutts Dogman Leader. <laughs> Dogman Leader's lower stomach was pelted. Dogman Leader has fallen to the ground. How about that? Dogman comes <laughs> and you just go yeah, mm, boom. And just give him a headbutt. That that's just yeah. So there's two of them. Coughing up blood. Wow, these guys have been in a fight of some sort. Interesting. Let's melee attack, but the other one is gonna attack us. Player demolished Dogman's right arm. Dogman's right arm has been crippled, is stunned. We're still okay. Is exposed to easy attack. For Where's the other one? Is he right there or is he away? Oh, he's going to melee attack us. Have to be careful. Well, let's parry. Uh, player parries Dogman's leader's move. Excellent. And he missed anyway. And he's attacking as well. The other one is on the ground. Let's leg trip. Dogman has fallen to the ground and must regain footing to continue. Okay, so this fallen and this one is getting up. So let's melee attack him. What? No! What? What? What happened? How? I was I was completely fine still. Dogman is bleeding. Leader gets up. Player trips Dogman. He missed. Oh, Dogman Leader launches a flurry of attacks at player and hits. Well, I couldn't get away from that one. Player is coughing a blood. I didn't even see that. See, this is the problem with that small window and, and lots of text and all pretty much the same. You don't sometimes see what's going on. And um, especially when fighting two targets, it would be nice to have sort of, a you know, maybe a window for each like this. These two windows would be great, you know, one for the left, you know, one for the leader, for example, one for the guy following him. Damn, they were really 
really hurt as well. <sighs> and we were doing quite well, I think. Damn. Damn. We survived for four, uh, for eight days. Oh, man. That was quite good. Well, I guess that was payback for all the dogmen I've killed. Oh, well. But death is a constant in this game. So thank you for watching. And we are going to continue next time when we try to be better. But this really works well. This uh, strong and tough combination. I like it. Just can't be fighting many things at once. That's the problem. It's not fair either. You cheating dogman. Oh well. I will see you then. Bye bye.